In this video, we are going to create the music staff that you see above. Step one is to go to your line tool and draw a line like that. Step two, go to our shape tool and we want to draw a small square like that. Step three, we want to go back and choose our select tool. We want to make sure that our alignment tools are on. Go to view and alignment. We want to make sure show guides for active objects is selected. Make sure our guide color is a color we can see and click OK. Next, we want to clone the line and we want to line it up exactly with our other line like that. And then we can use our arrows to move it up to make sure that it's in line specifically with the square. Next, we move our square down. Then we clone all three objects. Clone. Now we move them down to line up. And whoops, release. Once they're all lined up. And the last thing is we clone one more line. line it up with the other lines. Okay, now we've created the staff necessary, or the lines necessarily for our music staff. The next thing that we need to do is we need to create the other lines for our staff. So again, we want to take out our line tool and we want to just draw a line here at the end that fits. Okay, and if it doesn't quite fit, that is okay. You can manipulate the line to work in your favor. And there it lines up. Line. Perfect. All right, and I will use my arrows to move it just off the back end perfectly. All right, I'm going to take my square again, and I'm going to make my square a nice size so that it can fit and make it a reasonable length there. All right, so we've got our square. We want to choose our line, clone our line, move that into place, get our red lines like we want them, just like that, perfect. Then we clone our square again, if I can get that back. There it is. And we'll move my square down like so. All right, and then I want to clone these objects and move them down. Choose my square again. Move that down. One, two, three. And one more line, and we should be good. Clone that. And I'll move this into position. Just like that. Use my arrows to line it up. And then I want to get rid of this square if I can find it again. There it is. And I'll delete. All right. Now, the next thing that I want to do is I want to add some clip art. So I go over to my gallery, I search for music, hit return, go to my pictures, and here is my treble clef. I can double tap or I can choose the drop down menu and insert. I add it to my music staff. Delete any excess, grab the whole item, choose any one of these arrows, and I group it together. Now I have one object, and that is how you create a music staff. 